guys oh my god welcome back to another vlog i just dropped my do mum's dog off at the airport because i don't know if i told you guys but my mum and her dog are moving to spain no we're not spanish or anything like that it's the year of moving overseas 2023 and she's moving to spain and i just dropped off her dog so it's kind of like weird and you're just like oh you just really want her to get there already and so you know that they're all there safely already but people do this every day so i'm sure it's fine it's so weird i've never like had a dog fly overseas before like that's so crazy to me so i'm like um that's crazy but yeah the lady seemed pretty confident and she just drove off with benny in her van and her little crate thingy and she had it all set up so yeah but yeah i just thought i'd let you guys know because i know i told you last vlog that like things were a little bit crazy a little bit crazy because if my mom and her dog were leaving and i was helping a lot with that yeah so i've just dropped her off i had to stop at like there's this amazing bakery i was like i'm so starving <laughs> i'm so i got a sandwich and does anyone else just kind of like low-key love eating in their car like Guilty pleasure. I don't know. It feels like it's a secret. <laughs> Is that lame? Does anyone else think that? I'm like, literally no one can see me, even though my windows aren't tinted and I'm just parked on the side of the road. Like, try argue with me, but yeah, I'm going to devour the sandwich because I am so hungry. <laughs> Guys, I am not winning the sharpest tool in the shed award anytime soon. This nice new machine. You probably just saw clips of me using it. Well, I've been telling Ash all day that it doesn't work, that there's something wrong with it. No, there's something wrong with it. It was a user error. It was an ID10 T error. Yeah, because it's such a smart machine. So it's basically my dad's old machine. He was like, Do you want this machine? And I was like, Ah. Uh, yeah yeah i do anyway so i've just started using it and it's it's a very smart machine like it has a lot of like checks and balances within itself so like you don't use it incorrectly or you don't use it unsafely and so i was like oh my god it doesn't work no i just hadn't put enough water in the back so it wasn't gonna let me use it because it's smart and i'm not but thank goodness I realized that because I was really confused. I was like, I don't understand how this is not working. <laughs> it's like, mm, the machine's working fine. It's, it's that, that's not working. But yeah. started doing my nails and I was like why not show you guys how I do it because it's pretty easy I would say like these ones I've just started I feel like I have a bajillion one glitters flakes shimmers pigments and I just don't really use them for makeup so I use them for nail polish so I do like the first two nails and then the next three as you can see I just put a clear coat and then I wait for it to get like tacky like if you were doing fake eyelashes and what I'm thinking of doing is doing this as the undercolor to get this kind of color and then I'll do the flakes on top so I'm just tip the q-tip and then I basically just tap it on to the tacky nail polish and then you can just pat it in with your fingers and then it will stay see oh there you go she like that and that's why it kind of looks messy when i first do it because i'm just basically patting glitter on so this i wanted to do is my first coat it's really easy it's super fast and easy and i just put a paper towel down This is the weirdest angle ever. But yeah, I just put a paper towel down to kind of stop the counter from getting covered in glitter. But yeah, it's so easy. Um, let's please do not perceive this finger right now. So now I'm starting on the 
flaky layer. As you can see, that makes it just like way more fun. So again, I just use the Q-tip and I kind of sprinkle. It kind of depends, I feel like, how sticky it is, if I can use the Q-tip on my finger. And I like it because it's like, it's not perfect. So if you get like a little chip or something, it's not super obvious because it's just like glittery. And then you eventually tidy up the, the edges, but yeah. That's how I do it. Super easy and fun. Pretty. People are always like, oh my god, your nails are so fun. And I'm like, thanks. I did them myself. Thanks for watching my tutorial. I'm sure it was very helpful. <laughs> and then you just cover it with the top coat again. Yeah, and then it just stays sealed. It's so easy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. You know? Hey guys, this is not how I thought my Sunday would end. But someone not naming names but someone ate a dead bird mm -hmm. yeah they ate a dead bird and then threw it up so i've spent my sunday afternoon at the emergency after hours vet and just spent a lot of money that hopefully the insurance will pay some back what do you have to say for yourself lizzie I honestly think she'd do it again. Dogs are just funny like that. They'll just take a nice relaxing afternoon and eat a dead bird. And now I have to go home, give you a bath. It's so gross. Oh, yuck. But yeah, I did not expect this vlog to end like this. I did not expect my weekend to end like this. But here we are. I mean, obviously, obviously the most important thing is that she's safe and nothing bad is going to happen to her. But it's just like, it's just, it's just life, isn't it? You're just one minute, you're hee hee ha ha, like doing some cooking, just sitting down, chilling out. Next minute, I'm on the phone to the emergency vets because I don't know if I should bring her in. And then she literally vomits. And so they're like, yeah, no, you should bring her in. And I'm like, yeah, I agree. I'll see you soon. And they're like, yeah, see you soon. I don't usually have her in the car like this. She's just kind of shoved in, but I'm sure she rolled in that bit as well. So I just don't want her making my car all gross. Any final words to the people? Do you have anything to say for yourself? You'd do it again. But yeah, that is life, isn't it just? You say, or you think you're going to have a nice relaxing afternoon, and then your dog eats a bird. Surely one of the planets are in the microwave. Hopefully that's over soon. But yeah, let's hope that next week has good vibes, good times. This week's been good otherwise. You know, it's fine, everything's fine. We've got medication, thank goodness for... <laughs> thank goodness for modern medicine. I'm going to go home, give her a bath and see if she eats food she'll definitely eat food like they were like oh just see if she eats food i'm like this dog would eat food even if she had eat just eaten food like she's never not eating food like not eating food is not a choice on her list of things to do like it's always eating food is the choice but yeah with that said i'm gonna go home and i'm gonna stop filming because my phone my phone's also on low battery so hee hee ha ha live laugh love See you in the next one. Oh, SBCA. <laughs>